Growing up, because of my dad's line of business, I was exposed to cameras and audiovisual equipment. And I also found out that to succeed in life, you have to like what you do. I then found out that I loved working with cameras and the like. So when it came time to telling our story here, it was easy. Everybody talks about how the Western media doesn't talk about us in positive light. And we began to think that the only way we can solve this situation or do something about it is to tell our own story. We looked around and found out that in these parts, at least as far as politics, sports or music is concerned, everybody is covered. But there was nobody talking about fashion or what industry professionals or what individuals in the industry were doing as far as fashion was concerned. And we also thought that there were lots of people who had amazing stories, but nobody was telling their stories. So in comes Fashionista GH. The impact of Fashionista GH has been tremendous. We follow Ghanaian designers all over the world, and then we follow those here to recover fashion events. We put them up on our YouTube channel. The whole world sees it. The brands get recognition, and the people on the street also see what the designers are up to. We also have designers coming to us so that we promote their works on our Facebook platform, our Google Plus platform, and all our social media networks. And then as a form of flattery, we also find that now, people are beginning to do what we are doing. We think of it as flattery because we find that we have blazed the trail and many others are now following. Enter the internet. Amazing opportunities. Endless resources. Anything you want to do, at a click of a button, you just get it. And also, when you finish with your work, if you took it to a TV station or some media outlet, you have to pay good money. Internet is free or relatively inexpensive. The future for Fashionista GH, I must say, is blindingly bright. We intend or we are on our way to become the go-to source for Ghanaian fashion and lifestyle. We are going to be at the number one portal as far as knowing whatever is happening on the Ghanaian fashion scene is concerned. It's going to be a place where industry professionals can find their fellows and also the man on the street can find what the industry is up to.